is a sensational crowd that's building here at Suncorp Stadium for, as you said, a lot to play for for two very proud clubs. Brisbane trying to keep their season alive. As Jim Carey said in Dumb and Dumber, so you tell me there's a chance, Cam. There is still a chance for Brisbane. Well, yeah, there's there's definitely a chance. It might be an outside chance, but it starts tonight, doesn't it? They have to take care of this match first and foremost. They're playing against a side that's well and truly down the bottom of the ladder. They're equal with the West Tigers after that great win last night, but they got a lift tonight. And that man on screen right in the middle of the huddle, Adam Reynolds, He'll be a big part of it. Well, here come the Parramatta Eels. And after last night's win by the West Tigers over Manly, out onto Suncorp Stadium. There's some greats of the game there, including Steve Renoff, recently inducted into the NRL Hall of Fame. So Brisbane to the roar of the crowd, making their way out. And Paul Vaught and Adam Reynolds just mean so much to this team in so many different ways. Yeah, they, uh, they're a different side when he's not there, that's for sure. And uh, he, he needs to lift this whole team tonight. They really, they should be in a better spot than they are. And they need to win all three games. And they finish off with the Dolphins and the Melbourne Storm after this. So it's a hard, it's a hard go for them, but it starts tonight. It starts right here. And you'll see it all on... Channel 9's wide world of sports. <laughs> You're ready to call. Keep going. <laughs> that was good. He got a cue right after 32 years. We're underway. You could not ask for a better night for football. And because it went out ball, it'll be a play the ball. So they'll play the play the ball 10 metres away from the line here, Parramatta. What an opportunity it is. Former Bronco off and Gowie tackles. Eight metres away from Brisbane's line. Lane. He's wrapped up. Jensen in the tackle for Brisbane. They've got big numbers out here to the left. They elect to go short. And Campbell Gillard. He's wrapped up. Off and Gowie. Straight and hard towards the post. And he's wrapped up. Walters in the tackle along with Carrigan. Brown, his first touch. Gutherson, lovely ball. And running straight through is Pedersini. And it's the Eels in first. What a start for Parramatta. And their magnificent centre, Will Pedersini. Oh, what a start, all right, Salty. That's 11 tackles on the Harvey Norman replay. 11 tackles dove in their account for the night. Lovely little set piece out to their right-hand side. But and when they're on, it can be tough to run down. Here's Gutherson, wants it to swing back, and it does. Brown. Russell takes it, a juggle, and then... Oh, he keeps it in play here. Cartwright to Gutherson. Here's the kick. Here's the chase. Oh. There's the try. Let's play Harvey Norman replay. Here we go, Brown. Well, he doesn't quite get this on the mark, but the Broncos, they're not able to shut the ball down. Loose pass, offload. Away it goes. Gutho looks up. He's got two chases. And off end Gowie. He just beats all the defenders from the Broncos. They fell asleep a little bit there, Fatty, the Broncos. Well, they, they did, again, and, and they they just stayed alive, Parramatta. Great work, and, and Gutho, that's two assists already for him, try-wise. It was a race, <laughs> only two people chasing that ball. And they were two Parramatta players. Bang. Lockie. An easy one for him, and he converts. On the last, Reynolds kicking for Staggs and Cobbo. It's Staggs leading the chase. He bats it back. It evades Carrigan. It evades to Alungi, and it's picked up here. And Parramatta have it through Sivo, and Walters makes a vital tackle. Brown. Just get up. Wait. Parramatta on the front foot again. Penasini, he opened the scoring. Tries to get around Mariner, who makes the tackle. Russell. Runs out of dummy half. Inside Brisbane's 20, they go again here, Parramatta. 
Arcy goes short to Campbell Gillard. He had Gatherson lurking. Here's the last. Arcy. That pass is a beauty to Blaze to Lungy. Sebo! Micah Sebo with the try. That's his 99th. And the way the Eels have started, he might get 100 tonight. Down the other end, they've just been majestic. Absolutely majestic. And that's too easy. Absolutely too easy for them. Yeah. Carrigan. Reynolds. Sayla. Sayla puts in a kick. Here comes Coppo. He won't need him. Sailor gets it. Does he get the ball oh. down? I think he does. That's that's one of the greatest try-saving tackles you'll see all season. Reynolds drifting across field. Links up with Sailor. Can Sailor get away from his man? He can. It opens up for Tristan Sailor. And he gets around them. What a try, Tristan Sailor. In and away on Gutho. Harvey Norman replay. Just watch the trickery there for Madam Reynolds. Burns him with speed on the outside. Gets into the backfield. Then look at that. In, away. Too much speed for Gutho. Mike Acebo. Well, I think I reckon if he turned and chased a little bit early, he might have got there. Just look at the attempt to tackle here by Talungi. On it's a grab, grab, chip, drive in, use your shoulder. Every time you'll get beaten if you try and grab like that. And it's this young man, wow. He, he's good. He's really good. Bit different running style to his dad. Dad is like a wounded rhinoceros. Down the, <laughs> he was down the sideline, but he's good. Oh, the Ewing fan can. Cam, there it is. There it is. They're up and about. They're going off like a bride's nighty. <laughs> Lockie, it's all yours. <laughs> <laughs> Reynolds with the conversion and he's got it. Well, earlier tonight, a victory for the Bulldogs and they overcame a 12 0 early deficit to defeat the Warriors 34 to 18. But we'll talk more about this at half time. Stephen Crichton on report for a shoulder charge on Roger Tuovasashek. So, concern there for Stephen Crichton. But again, what is it now, Cam? Six, seven in a row. Yeah, I think we conceded in the second half. Yeah, it's like six or seven matches in a row where they've had zero points scored against them in the second half. That's that's a big effort. A big effort. That means they're fit. They got a great defensive system. Brisbane on the front foot. Rogers, uh, Reynolds to Rogers. Here's Rogers. Brisbane go back to back. Josh Rogers with the try, the halves combining, and we've got a ball game. And it's just like that. The Broncos are back in it. Broncos are now starting to tear them apart. This is a simple play. It should have been stopped. Josh Rogers, good skill by him. Well done, young fella. Reynolds slots the conversion. And we've got a four-point ball game as the second half ready to get underway. I hope you're enjoying the start of your weekend. Watching Friday night footy on Nines Wide World of Sports. Carrigan to Reynolds. Lovely ball, Rogers. It just got caught up there. Sebo's got it. And Reynolds. He tries to find a way through. Last play, Parramatta. Ten away from the line. Brown kicks. Here come the chasers. And, well, Brisbane just able to save the day. But it'll be a penalty here to the Eels. Taking his time. And he gets it. So Brisbane tap and go. Jensen. He'll play the ball a metre away from the line. The crowd nervously waiting in anticipation. They want their team to draw level. That's a lovely pass. Sailor to Cobo. There's the rule. And Brisbane are in. Yeah, that's good. That's really, really good. It's a Brisbane special. It's all on the Harvey Norman replay. Some good passes. That pass there. On that occasion, Sevo lost his patience 
and came in and left Cobo all on his own. Some running into fresh air. Well, what they did really well there, Parramatta, was they got off their trial line. They made it out to the, the 10 metre line, but from there they just they stood still and they're on their heels. The Broncos, they had all the momentum running forward. It's a big kick. Now Adam Reynolds swinging back. They're all locked up. I'm just going back to Katoni Staggs. He's only had the seven carries tonight, but we see it. Here we go. Oh, hang on. Reynolds has got it. He's been handed a gift. And he'll score right underneath the post. It's happened to be there. You know, it's just no one knew what was happening behind him. And then Reynolds on the Harvey Norman replay. The Trotters. There they go. <laughs> and the Brisbane Broncos, their season is still alive as they take the lead. Put him in the sprint on grand final day. No. <laughs> no. Don't think so. Salty. No. <laughs> but that just shows the experience of Adam Reynolds. He's been around for a long time, played many, many games. And he guides it through. Now Curtis McGrath is an Afghanistan veteran. So Receivo. Oh, he's had an air oh. swing. He's knocked it on. And Reynolds has got it. Reynolds. And now Staggs is over for Brisbane. Ten points. You think that might be 12 after this kick from Reynolds. But here it is, the Harvey Norman replay. High kick downfield. Sebo. Well, you'd expect him to take that one. Not a whole lot of pressure. It was six to go. From the commentary box, it looked like he actually passed that to Stags, but he put it on the boot. It's a nice little play. This view will show up beautifully. He summed it up. Come back to the short side. Nice little grubber ahead. He loves those short little kicks, and there's a try for Stags. Lockie? Yeah, I'm not sure why Mike Acebo turned himself to the side like that. He... Is Kevin Walters. His mood's changed in the last hour and a bit. Reynolds converts the try. 12 point lead now for Brisbane. Kenny Eels responds. Penasini. He scored the first try of the game for oh. Parramatta. Off and Gowie. Offload. Brown. Dylan Brown. That's a strong run. Lassick the dummy half. Goes down the short side, but Brisbane were awake to it. Rogers makes the tackle along with Mariner. Penasini now. Brown. Off and Gowie. Throws the dummy. Brisbane defence all over. The former Bronco. Now Arce with a kick, coming through his lane, he's getting there and scoring a try. Oh, the Eels are back. Yeah, great timing. And this is a really hard play to defend because Sean Lane, he was pushing up as a as a support runner. Sean Lane timed it perfectly. He's half a yard on side. He gets to the line. He's been playing with the number 10 on his back tonight. Usually... Crowd will tell the story. Easy as you like for Gutho. Six point ball game. Last play for the Eels. And they put it down. Brisbane are going to be able to hold on. It'll be a handover. Brisbane won't be in a hurry. It's been, you know what? It's been a fantastic win. Absolutely outstanding. And, you know, they showed a lot of guts, a lot of courage. And, uh, you know, 16 0 down to come back and win like that. That's, that's one of their best, best wins of the year. And you know what? They're alive. There's still a chance to make the top eight. And as you see all the flags and the fans, they're up. Great night here at Suncourt. Brisbane season still has a pulse. They came back from 16 0 down to record a six point victory. Full time at Suncorp. The Broncos, 30, have defeated the Eels, 24.